Hey guys, welcome back to Fjorder. Uh, I'm going to show you my new um, treehouse I have over here. I, I don't know why, I just am on a treehouse roll. So, here we go. Uh, this is kind of what I consider the front entrance. Um, just because I've got the little nice little plants in front of a window section um, and the two plants off from the side I've used um, just the plant the the crop plots and just regular crops along with the uh, species plants and I think it's uh, churched everything right up I really like it I'm starting this off at night I will give a day tour I promise. But I think it looks so neat at night. Um, I wanted to get this in. Um, yeah. So even the Dinosuchus fits out here. Mm. And this is my bedroom up there. Um, every other section has a door. So, makes it really convenient. This is where we transfer around because there's not a lot, of, a lot of dinos out here. And this is supposed to make me remember to take everything off before I transfer back to another map. We'll see if it works. And we're almost back to the start. Um, two sections over is where we started. And I've got another platform, and this is a mod called Bridge, ironically. And it has bridges. So, <laughs> took a minute to get it, to figure out how to get it to work like this, but I think it looks cool. So what I did was just did uh, another tree platform with all the extensions. And I'm probably going to raise it maybe a little mm, higher. So if anything aggros, my dinos don't run off of the platform. But yeah, I stuck a Jenny over here and some lights. And uh, I think it's going to work out good. Um, I don't know if I'll do any breeding over there. But I think it'll be good if I run out of room. And we are back at the beginning. Here we go. Got all of my uh, soul terminals set up. It's pretty convenient. I like it. And we've got our item collectors going. Um, this is another mod from Eco. Uh, the uh, aquariums they did a fantastic job so we've got this section all the way around and this is the work area I like it a lot it's really growing on me Took me a little bit to figure out where to put stuff, make it convenient. I did do a little moving around after I already set some stuff up. Because you never know until you move into a place. And once I got the dinos here, it really helped. It made it homey. If that's possible, it made it homey to me, uh, bringing all the dinos in. Um, this up here is that front section. Now I've just got the generator in here. Worked out pretty conveniently. And let's see. Um... Over here is that bedroom that I mentioned out there.
you can really get going too fast and shoot off of the of that side it's it's a little embarrassing and this is where I respawn uh, and keep a few of my little favorite tames and then there's a balcony out here a couple of plants it's a super nice view you'll get to see here in a little bit and we'll go back down here and then I'll show you all the top section now on the other tree house I had trouble doing a staircase but this one went off without a hitch He's got his feet sticking up in the way. This is the top. It's where we've got all the thylas. Uh, all my R ones. The R's are my favorite for sure. <laughs> uh, sorry it's so dark. It's just, I haven't put a whole lot of lights in here yet. But it's a pretty sizable area. And um, I think it's going to work out great for just storing extra dinas. I can put my May wings up here for my kibble. And I think it'll be fine. And I don't know what else to do up here besides just store store dinos. I don't I just haven't come up with anything yet. I like the area. It's a neat come on Mickey. It's a neat It's a neat area. But yeah. So this is our, our new place and so Oh, and there's another one up here. Let's show you this one before I go on my rant. This is that little section over here by my bedroom. And it's got access to the, it's got its own little balcony. It's got access to the um, landing that runs all around. I had a blast doing all of this. Oops. <laughs> yeah. So let me know what you think about the um, treehouse. Um, I really like it. It's really growing on me. Okay. The sun is up. So, I promised y'all would get to see it in the daylight. Um, you couldn't even see this, this part. Um, this is uh, my little ramp where I go get all my stone and stuff. Of course, we've got it secured with a dino gate so nothing can get up here. And, uh, All right, so the front that I showed y'all earlier is right here. And there's the um, the big platform over there. Why are we shooting a poor little Dodicarus? I don't know. I just... We'll let them take care of it because I'm really too busy. <laughs> so, so yeah, that's how we get out and go farming. And kind of give you a view up here.
I don't know what I'm going to use that big platform for. I just thought, you know what? I need something. I need a place where I can put extras, I guess. Maybe a little, um, a little breeding over there, maybe. Okay. So it doesn't look too bad in the daytime. <laughs> I really like how the lights look and stuff at night, but it's fine. Um, we got our little reindeer over here, finally. You know, I'm talking about you. Twist your ears. I'm talking about you. Um, you know, I'm not really good at these tours of my stuff. Um, so forgive me if I've, I'm like real nerdy about it because, uh, I, I'm not, uh, I'm not good at this, so um, hopefully I've shown it enough and um, didn't leave anything out. Um, and hopefully I did a good job. I don't know. But anyway, that's your uh, dime tour. And I appreciate you watching. And if you enjoyed it, give it a like. It's really helps me out and I really really appreciate it um, subscribe if you want to see more of my content and until next time I'll see ya